Hey there, buckle your seatbelts, I'm doing a dream host review 2023. I'm going to show you all the good and bad aspects. And by the end, I hope you'll find DreamHost a great web hosting provider for beginners. Let's find out why in my DreamHost review. To offer up a quick fire review, DreamHost is a veteran of the industry established over 20 years ago. So by this point, they should know what they're doing. And many DreamHost reviews state that it's one of only free hosting providers directly recommended by WordPress. However, after looking over DreamHost's performance, pricing, features, and ease of use, there's a bit more to unpack. First, could a beginner use DreamHost to manage a website on their own? Yeah, I mean, DreamHost is quite beginner-friendly, offering a quick WordPress installation and an overall clean design. It takes literally just one click for WordPress setup just like this. The same goes for installing SSL certificates or managing your email accounts. Everything is clear and easy to use. Don't get me wrong though, DreamHost is not only for WordPress. You can install any of the most popular CMS systems. The only slight problem for me is that the dashboard can be slow sometimes. Once, my WordPress installation took over 10 minutes. And that was not fun at all. Oh, and if I could ask you for a small favor, we're trying to constantly improve our reviews and comparisons. So, if you could leave your opinion on what you like to see more or less in our videos, that would be splendid. Even if you don't usually comment, your opinion is important, so don't be shy. So let's look at DreamHost pricing. To jump right to the point, it's one of the best bangs for your buck hosting options. It could be compared to some of the best cheap web hosting providers out there. The reason is that there are only two shared hosting plans, and they have everything you might need for a successful website. The cheapest plan currently goes for under $3 a month and renews for around $6. So it really reminds me of Hostinger, just slightly more expensive. You get 50 gigabytes of SSD storage space, a free domain name, and unmetered bandwidth. However, this plan limits you to one website and does not include domain-specific email inbox. So, if you only need one to host one website and that's it, Hostinger would be a cheaper choice. But the real value, however, lies in the aptly named Unlimited plan. It currently goes for under $4 a month or $11 a month after renewal. This option basically removes any limit from your resources. No limit for storage space, bandwidth, or emails. It also allows you to have unlimited websites, and there is no catch that I can find. You're usually still limited by the iNote amount or other things, but here, it's truly unlimited. Is DreamHost worth it? Yes. Combine all you get with affordable prices and it becomes the best web hosting choice for hosting a large number of projects in one place. If at any point in this review, you'll find DreamHost the right provider for you, don't forget to use the discount links I left in the description. Let's move on. Let's also quickly look at the security aspects of DreamHost. Every plan comes with firewalls, free SSL certificates, and daily backups. Sure, while most things are an industry standard by now, usually daily backups are left only for more expensive plans. So it's a major plus for DreamHost to get it with every plan. DreamHost also has one feature that I really appreciate, and that is free domain privacy. Free forever. Do you need it? Well, domain privacy is a feature where the provider hides your information from public registers. This allows you to stay more anonymous and avoid spam or phishing attacks by displaying only the company's information. If you can afford it, I highly recommend getting this for all your domains. And if you go with DreamHost, you get it automatically for all domains you buy. For those of you who might think that this level of security isn't quite enough, 
DreamHost offers the DreamShield malware remover tool for an additional fee. It's an add-on you can buy to automatically scan and clean your website for any malware or vulnerability. Overall, security-wise, DreamHost offers a lot for an affordable price. Okay, let's get into the nitty-gritty and look at performance. And unlike most providers that don't really talk about performance or just leave a good label on it, DreamHost gives you a few promises. It promises good fast loading times and 100% uptime results for your websites. But do they keep their promises? First, using GT metrics, we can see that my WordPress website managed to load in around 1.2 seconds fully. And this isn't just a default WordPress install we're testing. It's basically a fully fledged website. To put this into perspective, Google recommends loading under 2.5 seconds to have the best results. And it matches some of the best hosting providers out there. I can see why it's recommended by WordPress. Next up, that 100% uptime promise. It's not exactly correct. Since after testing this website's uptime for around 6 months, DreamHost had 20 minutes of downtime, scoring it at a 99.9999%. Okay, all jokes aside, this result for a period of this long is amazing and truly showcases DreamHost's determination for a stable performance. Okay, we've gone through almost everything I wanted to discuss. One last thing that I really like about the DreamHost approach to website hosting is that they offer you a lot of help if you're running a business on your own. If you have ever tried that, you know how difficult and time-consuming it can be to find anyone professional enough to do certain tasks, like designing your site, or managing your content when you're away, or helping with SEO optimization. Luckily for you and me, DreamHost offers various pro web services. You can hire a pro web developer to help you with social media, design elements, or just website maintenance in general. If something breaks, it's great to have help just at the click of a button. Of course, these pro services are paid and are a bit on the more expensive side, but getting everything you need from one provider really cuts your wasted time down. So, is DreamHost any good? Yeah, after going through all that it offers, it's a great shared hosting provider for everyone looking for an all-inclusive plan. Good performance, easy-to-use dashboard, and affordable pricing. If you're going to manage your website on your own, DreamHost will be your best website hosting. Hey, thanks for watching this DreamHost hosting review. If you still haven't, use those discount deals on the screen right now. <laughs> Don't forget to show some love by subscribing and I will see you all in my next video.